shut the front door. Okay, I'm confused. What's up you guys and welcome back to Cover Style. Tis the season to start shopping for the people that you love. And during Christmas, you know, white elephant gift giving is super popular. So a white elephant gift exchange is basically a party game where everybody opens presents that are absolutely outrageous, outlandish, hilarious, maybe a little inappropriate. It's the family show. So this year we thought it would be really fun to do a white elephant gift exchange with Clever Girls, but we wanted to do a who bought that version. And then based on how well the Clever Talent know each other, we need to figure out whose brain concocted that gift. I feel like things are gonna get really weird. Why am I wearing a crown? Because this is a weird episode, and it's gotta get in a weird mood. Let's get weird! Let's get weird! It should be entertaining, to say the least. All right, guys, enough talking. Let's get to shopping. Do I wanna go for funny, crazy, or weird? You know, or a combination of all three of those. Now, you wanna be thoughtful with your white elephant gift. Like you still want somebody to be able to like use it, but it also has to be funny. We have to keep our gifts to around $30. And I think it's a little bit difficult um, this time around because we're not buying for anybody specific. What if I literally just type in white elephant gift ideas? We're gonna start on Urban Outfitters because they have really, really fun, unique gifts that maybe you wouldn't even think of, but then when you see them, you're like, that's what I need. Immediately my mind goes, sex toy related. Can we put that on YouTube? I don't know. Should we be able to put on put that on YouTube? Yes. Okay, one of the things that I felt like was super trendy this year, I mean, it always is trendy, is the costume at the gas stations. They look like little like, Wacky waving inflatable arm flailing tube man. Honestly, they're right around the perfect price range. The adult costume's a little bit more expensive. It has to be that right kind of balance of impractical and practical, if that makes sense. Like I feel like it has to be something that's not just gonna sit in the corner and collect dust. Like this brilliant LED toilet lamp. Fun ramen bowl. I'm a hopeless romantic. All right, well. That was easy, guess I'm done, add to cart. There's a cutting board in Etsy that says, chop, chop, bitch, I'm hungry. That's kind of cool and fun. The avocado. Thanks. Pizza socks box, four pairs of mixed Hawaiian Italian pepperoni cotton socks. That is hilarious. Gone with the gin. Cocktails with a Hollywood twist. It sounds like too much work. Urban is, has definitely like some really, really fun stuff. I guess they have a lot of vibrators. Drew would like that. Oh, that'd be cute, like a candy bra set. Candy bra and panties. Aha, uh -huh. here we go. Candy G-string. Oh, they also have candy nipple tassels. <laughs> what is this? Crafting with cat hair. Crafting with cat hair, cute handicrafts to make with your cat. Crafting with cat hair shows readers how to transform stray clumps of fur into soft and adorable handicrafts. Ew! Add to cart. I could get them stripper heels. I could get them a candy thong. I could get them a clown mask. I could get them a wolverine mask. I could get them a candle that smells like beefcake. I don't know. There's so many possibilities. Tata -ta toasters, that's cute. Ooh, speaking of boobs, like boob candles, I love those. Ooh, but speaking of candles, maybe we can go that route. Oh, a Smoko Toasty Heatable Plushie. I don't even know what that means. Okay, we're opening that into a new tab because I really like that and it's $29. These are hilarious. Oh my gosh, these are so hilarious. No one's gonna want them, but it's like low key kind of funny because I'm not gonna buy you a $3,000 sneaker, so I'm gonna get you like some, you know, slippers instead. I feel like I might have just found the avenue I'm about to take. Oh man, it's so me. I feel like everyone's gonna know who it's me. Shut up, you goofball. Okay, you guys are distracting me. I gotta, I don't want to show you guys exactly what I'm going to get because I also want you guys to be surprised when it comes down to what it is. You have to watch to the end to find out what it will be. Well, this is gonna be hilarious for me and possibly not the person who has to open what I am giving them, but it's a good one. Several days later. My gift has arrived. Excuse me. 
Hi Christmas, hi Santa. Open this puppy up, see what's going on. Chicken nugget. First. Even though I look like a burnt chicken nugget, I still love myself. It's got little hands and it's got little feet, not to be mistaken for nipples. Who could get me this? For some reason, my spidey senses are telling me Madeline. The results are Dudley, 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 Dudley. Madeline. You guys, I'll know how I do it. I'll know how I do it. My gut never fails me. Thank you so much for my chicken nugget. Again, I don't know if he's a chicken nugget, but I'm gonna say he's a chicken nugget because it makes me love him even more. Dip him in some honey mustard. I will be opening my present from my white elephant person. Okay, it looks soft. Looks kind of like a blanket or a pillow. Is this a Nike swoosh? Hold on. Why are these moon shoes? You guys, they're literally bigger than my head. Shut the front door. Oh my god, and they literally have shoelaces, you guys. Is, does this say Dior? Can you guys see how funny these are? I'm gonna say Sinead just because of the logo. Okay, these are from Jackie. She was in my final, like, top two. I was gonna guess her, Sinead. I have so many questions. Like, where did, Jackie, where the heck did you get these? And did you know that they were gonna be so huge? I'm deceased. All right, you guys, the package has arrived. Feels like a nice, sturdy gift. Here goes nothing. Candle with prayer, fragile. Dude, dude. Oh my gosh. I already know, I already know who this is. <laughs> oh my God, this is freaking amazing. This is incredible. I like the gift. Funny gift, hilarious for white elephant. Let's see who got this for me. Who bought that? We all know it's Sinead. It's Shanana, but let's just double check, shall we? Sinead, it was honestly such a dead giveaway. Uh, Sinead, this is freaking hilarious. Snoop Dogg would be very proud. All right, the time has come. A little white elephant gift exchange. Okay, this is a very light bag. Okay, I'm confused. So these are Christmas gift nipple pasties. And you know what? I like to think of myself as kind of a bit of a connoisseur on weird Christmas things that exist. Didn't know that this was a thing. And then a little matching thong. Oh my God, that's adorable. Why do I think these pasties are so cute? What is wrong with me? Aw, maybe I'll put this on top of my tree. Bam, one down. I think this is a great idea for a white elephant. So there you go, if you needed a good white elephant gift, this is like top five best white elephant gift ideas. All right, so without a doubt, the moment I opened this, my first thought was Drew Dorsey. Okay, let's see, was I right? Of course, I was right, obviously. Drew bought this, and Drew is the kind of girl you need coming to your white elephant party. So, I ended up getting two gifts. So I don't really know what's going on if they go together. Woo! If you guys remember, we did a cheap versus steep wine edition, and the wine that I had this is very me, it has chickens on it. <laughs> Which y'all know I'm from North Carolina, I grew up with chickens, and I just love that this is so on brand for me. Gift number two. Just take me very much back to college. <laughs> I only know one person who is this serious about wine, and y'all know it's Warren Powell. Pray to God nothing snaps. It looks very natural. Tastes like college. What's it is, your lips? It's so good. Okay, officially Lauren bought this for the who bought that. And honestly, nothing screams more Lauren than this. This is really cute. I actually really like this wrapping paper. I might need to get this wrapping paper. You guys, this is an inflatable costume. 
Honestly, this is kind of perfect. So I almost feel like this could possibly be a Lauren or Drew gift. This is so funny. There's even instructions, pull your head through the elastic neckline, put on the costume head like a hoodie, inflate the costume. Okay, you guys, another solid episode of Who Bought That. I wanna know if you guys got any ideas for your own white elephant exchanges. Let us know which one was your fave. Comment section below. Also, click right on over here for even more clever fun. Happy holiday, you guys. Mwah.